deep, slow, painful grind down the Japanese twin engine line starts with a pleasant surprise. J1N1 is surprisingly good for its BR of 2.0. But how do you play it? Well, like any other interceptor, climb, take out a bomber or two. If no bombers are left, check the below for fighters and start descending with minimal throttle or zero engine power. Boom and zoom with what you have left in your guns, return to base. This is how it goes in theory, but usually at step 2 you might have run out of ammo for the Type 99 20mm gun. Yes, it only has 60 ammo. I use universal belt as the high explosive fragmentation ammo contains a filler of 16.83 grams of TNT equivalent. If the plane is new for you, use the tracer belt to learn the lead. Sadly, the tracer ammo has less boom in it. As you can probably guess, the 7.7 MGs are a complete joke. Use whatever belt you feel like, these guns suck anyway. At least there's a lot of ammo for them. J1N1 is able to fight even some of the more agile planes if they come to your altitude. To show the agility, you need to watch this unedited boring footage here. Remember to have some trigger discipline and don't play into your opponent's game. Maintain the altitude and let them come for you. If you intend to use combat flaps, open them for a fraction of a second, otherwise they'll rip off. Prepare for a kill and... No niinpä vittu tietenkin. Let's continue with few combat tips. How about we say that the enemy ended up on your 6? Don't try rolling because it's not a good trick with this plane. No need to worry. There are two dual 7.7 MGs on your back. Yes, the damage is somewhat inconsistent with them, but Tracer Belt can scare off some fighters. Turrets even work if you miss the bomber you are chasing by quickly swapping into the gunner of you and spraying them with the hail from 7.7 P shooters. Just don't do like me here and fly in front of a B-34. I wouldn't recommend using the turrets as the main combat method. Enemy on the tail of a Japanese plane usually equals one burning Japanese plane and one critted opponent. But what else to say? J1N1 is a good starter interceptor for its BR. If considering the optimal game mode and role for J1N1, I'll throw it here. The center mounted 60 kilo bombs are not much of a use in ground realistic and you don't have enough ammo or firepower to do close air support. Victory always over for a few measly kills.